do you know what the pressure <laughs> of nine G's feels uh, like? It's just part of everyday life for the U.S. Air Force Thunderbirds, who are in town for this weekend's Orlando Air and Space Show. Today, they decided to give a Seminole County man a day he will not forget. New 6 is Amanda Castro explains why he ended up on the Thunderbirds' radar. Clayton Donnan is far from the classroom, strapping in for the ride of his life. I wasn't nervous. Uh, it was just a fantastic, phenomenal ride. He suited up and sat in the back seat of this F-16, joining the U.S. Air Force Thunderbirds, who selected him as their hometown hero. Donnan is the Seminole County Teacher of the Year. He teaches at Crooms Academy, spending the last 18 years teaching games and simulation, 3D modeling and animation, as well as teaching steel band. Friday's lesson took him high in the sky, hitting up to nine G's and looping in the air. Donnan says this was an experience he always dreamed of. Obviously, I, we make games, I've, I've played games. Um, the idea of like flying a real plane is something that I've like dreamed of ever since uh, I was a little kid and I was flying, you know, PC simulators when I was like 10 years old. <laughs> The Thunderbirds in town for the Orlando Air and Space Show, happening this weekend at the Orlando Sanford International Airport. Major Ryan Yingling says this flight was the least they could do for Donnan, who does so much for his students. Recognizing his service and his excellence, uh, which is, are things that we strive for, that's about the best we can ask for. Even giving Donnan the chance to take control. Once he got the handle of it, we were doing some cloud chasing and, and he wanted to pull G's, so he did great. The size of the smile on his face is as big as Florida. Donnan's family on the tarmac watching every moment. This is just amazing and he's so lucky to be able to do this. His principal adds he deserves yeah. this opportunity and the recognition, saying his passion for teaching lifts his students to new heights. He's put in so many hours and so much time individually with students and their families and for him now to have this reward, unbelievable. In Seminole County, Amanda Castro getting results, News 6.